Next, a mental health call in Newport News that ended with a man shooting at officers. Earlier today, the police chief released a timeline of events and before heading to breaking news, Michelle Wolf showed us how officers responded to this volatile situation and the training they received to handle it. Police Chief Steve Drew said the wife of 42 year old John Alcinder called 911 last night concerned that he didn't sound like himself, had a history of drug use and may have overdosed. Police responded within minutes and spent the next two and a half hours trying to de-escalate the situation. Drew says three officers arrived at Park Place Commons at 813 PM. Alcinder was in a car in a parking garage and was drinking with a gun within view. Drew says two minutes after officers arrived, Alcinder fired the gun inside the car. In the holiday season, one of the things we always talk about is individuals that may be struggling through some things. You never know what's going on inside someone's life. Drew says officers tried negotiating with Alcinder over the phone for almost two hours. At 1029, he exited the car holding the firearm and fired around. A few seconds later, he fired a shot at officers. Drew says a struggle began and another round was fired striking an officer's taser. I'm thankful that none of the officers were injured. Drew says officers returned fire. Alcinder was struck twice and received immediate medical attention. Nobody in this in this profession ever wants to have to be called uh, to use deadly force. Drew says he spoke with Alcinder's wife this morning and visited the man in the hospital. We had a short conversation and I told her that she matters to me and I just wanted to check on her and I did. I did not go in the room but I did put eyes on him directly. The three officers involved were put on administrative leave. All three had activated their body cameras during the incident. The measure they took to try to de-escalate before that had to occur uh, was just extraordinary. Drew's critical incident stress management team receives training every 90 days. Dr. Janelle Royster, a licensed professional counselor supervisor, runs the training for Drew's officer. Whether it's serious mental health illness, trauma-informed care, like we, we educate them on different aspects of uh, mental health so that they have a whole person wellness. So when they are responding to an event, such as what happened, they can come in with a clear mind and open communication. They have all of the information they need so that they can manage the situation. Alcinder has serious injuries, but is stable. He's facing three charges of attempted malicious wounding, three charges of felony use of a firearm and drug charges. In Newport News, Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.